According to a story in The Hollywood Reporter, 20th Century Fox has picked up the rights to the illustrated novel Fall of Gods and is developing it for a feature film release with the Maze Runner director, Wes Ball, on board to helm the project. The Fall of Gods is described as follows. He, the gods have long ago <coughs> vanished. In their place, two rivaling races now inhabit Midgard, humans and Jotnar. Fifteen years ago, a coalition of chieftains drove the Jotnar race from Midgard. Now, from each side of the border, humans and Jotnar each eye each other with hatred and suspicion. When his wife, the estranged daughter of one of the Midgard's most powerful chieftains, is mysteriously kidnapped, a retired warrior takes up the hatchet and sets out to rescue her. But he risks unleashing the wild demon buried deep within him and losing his soul in the process. His journey will bring him into conflict with terrible forces as a cynical plot is revealed and the, darth, and the dark mythological past of the North begins to awaken once more. John, do you buy or sell the sounds of Fall of Gods? I buy it. This is a really interesting sounding proposal and you know what maze runner is one of those films that to me on the surface just look like trash i mean it looked like another city of bones to me at mm. first and it's actually not a bad little film and i'm i'm kind of looking forward to um well whatever whatever it is scorch trials scorch trials you'll never last a day in the scorch they should just call it little finger and be <laughs> off with it but anyway <laughs> what's really interesting though is this west ball dude he's like 29 years old this is a kid and he's already got these two major motion pictures on his belt. He's got this one coming. Honestly, this sounds like a really cool play, depending on the style, depending on the budget, what they do with it. But on its surface, it sounds great to me. I'm going to give it a buy, Schnepp. Yeah, I'm going to buy it, too, looking at just at the pre-production art or those designs that you know you see associated with it. You just do a search for Fall of the Gods. It looks, like, epic. I mean, I think they should get Amana Marth to do the musical score. It's black metal. <laughs> what's up? And, um, yeah, I buy it. I can't wait to see this movie. I absolutely buy it. I I still have bad taste in my mouth from uh, the Immortals and Clash of the Titans and Wrath of the Titans. Right. I know this goes away from this, a little bit of that mythology, but it's in the same vein. And I love that type of stuff. This sounds really intriguing. And I agree. The director, like, I didn't... I. After seeing movies like uh, Beautiful Creatures and and then, I don't know, the other one with little, there's a, there's a bunch of these garbage young adult ones that I thought Maze Runner was going to be another one. And I didn't necessarily love the movie, but I thought the director did a really good job with what could have yeah, been he did. garbage. Um, but this sounds really cool. It sounds intriguing. I love the idea of this of this warrior. It's almost like Perseus who's who's going out there, has to has to go and rescue um whoever it is with the, the fact that he doesn't want to wake up this demon and has to fight for his soul. There, Like you said, Schnepp, it sounds like it's calling for a nice big epic movie and one that we haven't, that we're not really that familiar with. I mean, granted, yeah. it's a book, but we don't know. It's 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 fairly, it's original. It's it's one of these movies that you're like, oh, wait, this isn't just a property that's been done a thousand times. It's a brand new take on uh, this mythology. Plus all the all the ones you mentioned are all Greek mythology and this right. is Norse mythology. Right. So right. it's a little, it's a different and more interesting to me just because that hasn't been played out yet. Like Clash, the Titans, Wrath, the Titans. So that's all like, you know, yeah. Greek mythology. And I right, believe right, there right. is a rule right now in in the, the guidelines that say if you're doing a movie on Norse mythology, uh, you have to have death metal. I, I believe that's that's in that there has somewhere. To death just should metal be. has to be there. You know, yeah. we were saying before, we were talking about it before the show started, it's like none of us have actually read Fall of Gods. If any of you guys have read Fall of Gods, please let us know in the comments section. Let us know what you think of the graphic novel itself, or as they're calling it, the illustrated novel itself, and let us know what you think of the, uh, how it's going to do or how it could play out as a movie. We'd love to hear thoughts. 